सब्सक्राइब कीजिए मार्क ट्यूटोरियल यूट्यूब चैनल को और प्रेस कीजिए इस बेल आइकन को ताकि आपको मिल सके हमारे लेटेस्ट वीडियोस सबसे पहले हेलो फ्रेंड्स टुडे इन दिस वीडियो वी विल सी दी प्रोसेस ऑफ फ्लोर वाइज बिलिंग बट बिफोर दैट वी विल अंडरस्टैंड दैट हाउ फ्लोर वाइज बिलिंग इज बेनिफिशियल फॉर योर बिजनेस If you deal in products of multiple brands like if you are dealing in FMCG then the products of these companies will be available to you like Cadbury Parley Nestle etc and suppose if you have maintained different sections for these products on same floor or on multiple floors in your store like there is a separate section for Nestle and a separate section for Cadbury then you will get the benefit from store wise billing that whenever you will generate the bill for the items of different floors then its bill will be generated in just single attempt and then automatically those will be bifurcated floor wise and then you can dispatch the goods after collecting them easily so now let's see its process in the software for this firstly you will go to masters then to mark setup then go to control room and search auto generate then do accept and now firstly you will type hash 7% here for auto generate different bills for company tax or item so that we can generate bill on the basis of different options the next option is generate for all or split means if you want that only one bill should be generated for all items then select a and if you want that bill should be split after 5 items or after 10 items or it should be separated then select s and then you will mention that number here after how many items you want to split the bill so as we will select a for all then next is ask before generate means if you want that it should ask before generating single bill or separate bill then you will select an option here according to you like you will select y for single and select s for separate so as we select y for single and you will take care of this thing that there will be selection on single by default in single next is generate for all issued sales and sales returns and sale means You want to do the floor wise billing for stock issue or for sales and sales return or for sale. After this is generate only for invoice, challans or both. Means you want to do the floor wise billing only for invoice or for challans or for both. So select I for invoice, C for challans and B for both. friends after this is an option that on which basis you can generate the bill so as we have to do the floor wise billing then we will select f for floor now we will press escape key and we will save the changes after this you will go to masters then to inventory masters and then go to floor wise store room and now firstly you will mention that how many store rooms are on which floor So as we have three store rooms in our first floor then we will mention 1 2 3 here in floor 1 Similarly there are two store rooms in second floor so here we will mention 4 to 6 in floor 2 So in this you will mention the number of store rooms here in floor wise Then now keep pressing enter key so in this way it will be shown to you updated successfully After this you will specify that of which company's item is in which store So for this you will go to masters then to inventory master and then go to company master and now you will select the company so suppose we will select micromax then now we will mention one in the store room number field means the products of this company is in store one now press page down key and will save similarly we will select another company and we will mention the store room number field here as well Suppose we will enter here four that items of this company is in store number four. So in this way, you will mention that of which company's item is in which store. After this, we will generate the sale bill, for which we will go to transaction, then to sale bill. And now, if you want, then you will mention the mobile number, name, and enter the remarks. 
then now we will select items and now suppose we will select here items of different floors for example we will select micromax x1 which is an item of floor 1 then we will mention its quantity similarly suppose we will select second item of floor 1 then mention the quantity and now we will select the item of floor 2 as we select Nokia BH108 and then we will mention its quantity so in this way you will select items according to you then now press tab key and save the bill and as you will save the bill then you will see it will be shown here that two items are of first floor and one item is of second floor and along with it you will see by default selection is on single bill because we have selected Y for single bill after this we will select that do you want to generate floor wise separate bill for these items or want to generate the single bill so as we will click on separate bill and you will see here it is shown floor 1 press escape key and now here it is shown floor 2 means item bill is generated for floor 1 and floor 2 press escape key again after this go to transaction then to sale and then go to modify bill so you will see bills are separated you will see separate bill is generated of the items of floor 1 and separate bills of items of floor 2 is generated so in this way by using floor wise store room option you can maintain the products of floor wise different companies thanks for watching